Hey guys, it's Al Sherman here, and today, as you will see, another sunset. And today's video is going to be a shout out slash um, true a true friend. Now, the person we're going to talk about is um, Kaylin. Now, Kaylin is a really nice girl, and Kaylin, if you're um, watching this, um, please um, message me whenever you do and share this video. So anyway, let's not waste any more time and let's get it started. So. Kaylin is one of the rarest girl that, that is so nice. You know, I'm talking about like very rare. What I mean by rare is what I mean is like, you know, she's so nice to me. I never met anyone that is so nice to me. And I always never felt so happy around her, you know. I mean, yes, we're just friends, you know. I mean, it's not, it's, like I said, we're not, we're not, like, more than friends, you know. Don't think, like, oh, yeah, you know, you know, they're not, like, more than friends, but again, you know. So, bef before we start, um, again, um, shout-outs to Kaylin, you know, I'm hopefully she's watching this, so, yeah. Um, but again, so, I care about her a lot, to be honest. And she's a really nice girl, you see, she's one of those girls that don't, judge themselves the way they look you see that's what i like about her you know she doesn't judge herself to say like like oh yeah you know what does it matter like if i wear makeup or it doesn't matter like if i have to if my hair is straight or not or well well you know like oh yeah are you, oh it doesn't matter with the way the, like well yeah a certain outfit i wear you know, you know what i'm saying like it doesn't matter and that's what i like you know she doesn't judge herself and you know and, and you know and and you know and you know even if she is pretty you know even if she you know, tries to take the pretty pictures. She, she, she's so nice. You know, she has a nice inside and a nice outside. Like she has a nice personality. You know, and that's what I like about her. You know, she never, she never judges herself, and that's one thing I love. And you know, that's what I like. And that's the thing. I met someone that that's like a girl that I like. You know, you know. But like I said, it, it's I care about her a lot. And it's never going to change. And you know, she's so nice to me. I never met anyone that was that was so nice to me. Now, you know, things about my now. Now here's my feelings about her. How I feel about her. She's a really beautiful girl. She has a sweet heart, like a a, a goat of heart, like legit, like a goat of heart. Like she's so nice to me, you know. I mean, I wish I could date her, you know. You see, what I want to do is I just, when I get my license, I want to take her to places and stuff. I don't know, like, um, like, take her out to dinner and stuff and, and other places like that. Like, I don't know, like, um, whatever the restaurant she, she wants to go. You know what I'm saying? Whenever I get my license, you see? And she makes me really happy from the, from the inside out. And she makes me feel special half of the time. And that's what I like, you know, she, she's so nice to me, and, you know, and, and that's what I like, she's so nice to me, and yeah, so, and that's what I like, you know, she is pretty busy most of the time playing softball, you know, you know, like I said, I, I respect her because she likes to play She's into sports, you know. It's totally fine by me, you know. It really is. It's fine by me. Because you know what? Everyone has the right to, um, to be wherever they want to play. And there's nothing wrong with playing softball and all that stuff. I mean, the most part is... The most part is... You know, I'm just happy for her, you know. I mean, she's really good at it, you know. And the sad, sadly but true, I haven't seen her play softball before. But I've seen pictures of, of her in her uniform on, with playing softball on her team. But that's the only thing I've seen the picture of. But other than that, I just haven't really seen her play it before. But yeah, but that's the thing, you know. And another thing is, do you guys think, is she my girlfriend? And do you think I want her as my girlfriend? And no, she's not my girlfriend, and yes, she's just a friend, and yes, I would love to have her as my girlfriend. But, unfortunately, we're just friends. And it's for, and it's gonna stay that way. I mean, I, I want it to be more than friends. 
right? Because she has, she, I have, I have to respect her feelings too, you know. Just because I have a crush on her doesn't mean, oh yeah, you know, just because you know, I, I'm just gonna like, oh yeah, you know, I'm just gonna tell, oh yeah, we should date, like, oh yeah, I should just, tell, I should, I, like, um, co keep convincing her to date me and all that stuff. No, I don't want to do that because she has, because top of that, she's busy with softball and all that stuff and and softball. I don't, I really don't don't believe it. it's she's good at it like i don't believe it i heard i heard a lot of i heard a lot of stories of her like saying like oh yeah she helped the team one and all that stuff she helps the team out i'm like damn remind me not to piss her off when it comes to when it comes to softball I'm like damn because she's good i'll tell you that she's good and you know and i'll tell you why i can't date her because you see Something some something happened last year. I mean, I'm not gonna get to full details about it because you know, and you know, because if she watched this video, watch this video. I don't want her to like think like, oh yeah, it's her fault. It's really not her fault. You know, I should have just understand. You know, you know. I mean, I don't want to make her. I don't want to put this on her, making like, oh yeah, making her look bad. You see, the thing was, I asked her out last year. You know, and she said no, and then. After she said no, then I um, after I went to the table, I just had a huge breakdown. Like I I had a breakdown, and then then people started laughing at me, and then I I started I had a huge meltdown with the other people at the table. Not the table that she was in, the she the people that the table that she, that, that she was on, but the table on the other on the other. And then you know they were taking pictures on me and putting it on. I was like, I better not find that crap on Snapchat. If it does, if I find that on Snapchat, you're going to. See you're gonna see what's gonna you're gonna see what's gonna happen because I was I would speak to the principal and if you if if I find myself posting online crying because because my feelings were hurt because my feelings got rejected you know but now and then you know as I went to my um counselor you know it's like is this was like around nine period and all that stuff and nine period and then what happened was. You know, she was nice enough to take her whole, the whole period of her class, like, legit. Took her whole period out of her class to talk to me. And I would never see anyone that would do that. Anyone would. You see, I didn't know that she would care that much about me. Like, I honestly didn't notice. Like, to me, like, every other girl in the school, they don't care about me. That's the whole thing. They, they don't care. They don't care about me. They don't. They don't care about me. And I never seen a girl that much of a heart that would really care about me like that. Now that's something right there. That now that's a rare girl, a rare for a girl to do that for a guy, especially when when it's in a special ed. And she told me she explained to me, you know, she's not interested in dating. You know, she said, you know, she wants to focus on her education. You know, which is I, I respect. You know, I I do respect that. She says she wants to focus on her team and all that stuff. And yes, I do respect that. You know, I have no problem with that. You know, they want to they want to focus on their stuff and focus on their plans and goals and futures and stuff. And yes, I do understand that. And you know, but it doesn't make her a bad person. It makes her good. You know, because in the future she might get what she dreams about. You know what? You don't know, guys. She's a really nice girl. You know, Caitlin, if you're also watching this, you're still a good friend. You know, and I just never. You hope you never forget that. I don't, well, I'll never forget that. You know, you always be a good friend to me, you know. I mean, I will, one of these days, if I do get my license, I want you to come out, come out and, and, and do a sunset video with me. Just the two of us. Do a sunset video with me, you know, talk and have fun, you know, or bring, bring your, bring like one of your teammates to come do the video with me. I mean, I'm more than welcome to bring a, I'm more than welcome you can bring one friend, you know. I have no problem because I always want to do a group video, like a, a group, like video, a sunset video with a group. Like, that would be considered as a special edition. And as long as I'm with a girl and all that stuff, mostly her, she could be featured into, the, into this special edition. Like I said, you could be featured in the special edition, and then trust me, when you do, it'll say it's going to be the, the biggest sunset videos of the histories i ever done. And trust me, when I mean it, I mean it. But anyway, guys, th this video is getting a little too long. So anyway, um, if you enjoyed these videos, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. I daily sunset. You know, guys, Kaylin made me happy. And, and you know, the second I saw her, I never seen a girl that was so, has a, such a nice heart. Because I, I never, never, I never seen anyone that was so nice to me. And I appreciate her. 
and I'm glad to have her as my friend, you know. I mean, I do wish she was my girlfriend, but what you going to do? I have to respect her feelings, and I have to respect her. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, just, uh, again, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. Like daily sunsets. And anyway, you guys have a good night, and um, take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.